Hi friends. First of all, happy new year to everyone. The second thing is, I recently hinted about an experiment that I am growing cucumbers using just maxi grow nutrients. Today I want to share some results. I got some results and I can't wait anymore to share the excitement. This is a cucumber variety called quick snack. It is a parthenocorpic variety meaning all the cucumbers we see here are female flowers and we don't need pollination at all. So they, it's not even self-pollinated. They don't need pollination at all. That's what the parthenocorpic variety is. And today is day 50. Look at these beautiful cucumbers. Not one, but two. I'm using uh, just the tap water and in the initial days I mixed a half a teaspoon of maxigro nutrients for every one liter of water. Once the plants turned into this uh, flowering stage and uh, as I'm seeing these baby cucumbers, I bumped up the nutrition and uh, started adding uh, one teaspoon of nutrients for every one liter of water. If you look at the instructions, the package instruction says one to two teaspoons of uh, nutrients per gallon so compared to that what i'm feeding is definitely a lot but definitely one to two teaspoons for every one gallon of water is not working especially for cucumber plants so for all the fruiting plants i always start with a half a teaspoon for every one liter of water and once the plants enter into flowering stage, I bump it up and add one teaspoon for every one liter of water. That is working very well for me. Of course, you can experiment and see which one is working out for you. But for me, half a teaspoon at the beginning and later on, one teaspoon for every one liter of water. So that's how I am feeding Maxi Grow for a long time and that is working very well for me. And not only these cucumbers, these cucumbers should be ready in uh, two or three days. And I see some more cucumbers showing a pretty good progress. We can compare here. This is one of the baby cucumber. This didn't show any progress. It just stuck at that baby cucumber stage. Anyway, this cucumber has no life. So I'm going to remove it and put it next to a cucumber that is showing progress. Look at this. We can clearly see the difference here. Once the baby cucumber shows a little bit of progress like this, we can definitely hope that this cucumber will turn into a matured cucumber like this. And quick snack cucumbers don't grow big. They are pretty small. They are like finger size. We can definitely start harvesting cucumbers now if we want to. But I have grown quick snack cucumbers in the past. So I'm pretty sure this is going to grow a little bit big. So I'm going to wait two to three days. And it is very important to harvest the cucumbers as they are maturing. Otherwise, the new cucumbers don't show any progress because these cucumbers will keep on taking the energy. So harvest the cucumbers as soon as they are ready and give the chance for the new cucumbers. And this plant is still doing really good. There are a lot of baby cucumbers all over the plant. Normally, when the plant reaches to this huge, I cut the tops to stop the growth of the plant but on this plant I did not do anything. I didn't want to touch the plant because this is the first time I am growing with Maxi Grow. I just want to let it grow and uh, see its growth. Now that I have the confirmation that I can grow cucumbers just using Maxi Grow nutrients, I am going to go back to apply my tips and now I am going to cut a decent size of this vine and I am going to start a new plant using the cutting. Anyway, this is pretty good news and a pretty good experiment. This experiment is not completed yet. I still need to see good progress from this plant, but I can't really wait anymore to share this excitement. That's why I'm sharing this quick video. All right, that is all for now. Once again, happy new year and happy gardening. See you all in the next video.